Six years ago, I went into the woods six times a day. Today, I entered for the first time in three years. I slapped a bug off my face as I walked in. Memories came flooding back into me as I looked around. I saw my brothers using machetes and knives to mark and hack down those forest trees to make a path to our fort we spent hours upon hours making. I saw Michael and Jake sword fighting with sticks around the ditches, trying to push each other in. I saw myself trying to keep up with my brothers as I sprinted through those woods, trying to catch a rabbit. I was home. The birds were chirping as I tried to follow the dismantled path to my old keep. I heard a rustle in the tree above. Above me was a squirrel. I laughed to myself because six years ago, I would have run the other way. Jumping over a ditch, I noticed the old tree that Michael and I tore down with our own hands. Michael always thought we were really strong for tearing it down, but I knew it was simply rotted. Journeying through the green, I saw an old rope that Jake had tied to the tree to climb. Yet another laugh echoed through the forest, because Jake never succeeded in climbing that tree. After passing through some thorns that would have also turned me away six years ago, I saw it. The fort. I walked down the ditch onto the longboard we had put out to cross. Snap! It tore in half as my second step was taken. After climbing up to the ditch the hard way, I walked and noticed the old piece of wood that we had tried to hammer together to make a shield to protect us from enemies. That board snapped in half after a fight broke out between the three of us. I smiled nostalgically as I walked over it. I stumbled over to the so-called house made of branches and leaves that Michael, Jake, and I were all so proud of. I turned around to see all the memories that were made in this forest and became overwhelmed with nostalgia. This forest would always be special to me.